this is the energy vibration um, reading for the Aquarius and Moon and Rising I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back it is the month of May this month of May is the energy of the Empress and with the energy of the Empress that is an earth energy so this month of May is going to be a very very balanced um, month okay I like changing up the readings and I'm changing up because um, I like doing things differently I like um, being um, you know very creative in things I'm sharing one of my most favorite space in my apartment with you guys you can see me in there <laughs> but um, I decided not to be on camera this um, this month um, because I want to connect with these new decks that I have and these new decks are extremely positive and I need to um, have um, a different sort of a feelings that is coming in in this month okay so this is like my favorite space in the house uh, okay so this month looking at this month is it's gonna have five weeks and with these five weeks there are going to be um, a situation that is going to be applying to each and every one of us so it's a wonderful wonderful energy that is coming um, through in this five weeks I am using this deck I love this deck it is um, the fountain Tarot deck okay so here we go this month of May for you Aquarians you have the energy of the world this is such a beautiful energy because this is an, a month of the hurt sign and this is also the energy of the hurt sign so this is wonderful and this is um, extremely positive because what is here and what is transpiring for you guys is that this energy of the world is the ending of situations that are transpiring in your life and has been transpiring in your life and these situations is about to clear up and this is going to be very positive because what is going to transpire is that your life and wishes and um, some of your dreams and success are about to come out and this is going to be extremely positive so I basically basically love um, this energy that is coming up for you guys in um, this month so as we look at this month it is five weeks we have five weeks in this month and um, I am loving this five week because it's very good it's um, a very positive and this is what is transpiring in this five week the first week is the energy of hair for you guys and this going to be having the energy of um, the um, people over the age of 40 so in the five weeks a lot of people are going to be having situation over the week uh, over the age of 40 so if you're 40 and over you are going to be having situations in your life and we are going to be looking to see what are the situation and how they are going to affect you the energy of the seven of ones is here which is a fire energy that is coming up in the second week this is really really a positive energy in the sense that um, this seven of ones is that you're skipping over obstacles you're moving away um, from things that are happening and transpiring but yet still you're trying to move ahead and this is going to be good because the seven of ones is basically protecting you and helping you to move on to move out of the way of uh, people and situation that no longer serves you as we look at the third week we have the energy of the ace of ones and the energy of the ace of ones is um, extremely positive because this is a new start that is coming in for you this new start for a lot of people is going to be with work so let's say if the people over the age of 40 were having situations with work and that sort of a situations it's going to be clearing up now and the new possibilities new opening new understanding are going to be coming in between people and this is what is going to be showing up so um very very positive um i think extremely positive because you have the shift of the energy of the world then in the fourth week we have the energy in the fourth week we have the energy of inner strength okay inner strength this is um the number um 11 card 
and in this deck because this is a wonderful new deck and in this deck the energy of the inner strength is coming up and is here to um, help you to understand certain situations that is going on in your life and certain um, situations that is going to be transpiring and this is actually very positive because what does the same for you is that this is letting you know that you are going to find the inner strength especially people over the age of 40 is going to find the inner strength to move on in your life in positive um, situation and positive way you're going to be finding that fire energy that passion um, to lead you that we have the energy of judgment and the energy of judgment this is a basically a positive energy because with the energy of judgment what this is saying is that good news is about to come to a lot of you a lot of you who have been looking for a new start a lot of you who have been thinking um, to move on in a positive way this is going to be happening for you guys so this is going to be extremely positive and in a very smart but wonderful way that this is going to be transpiring in your life and this is going to be helping you to move forward in a very very positive way so um, this is going to be good I basically love um, this um, deck and your energies that has come out okay let's look and see um, what is basically transpiring for you guys in um, the first and second week because the first and second week have a situation to do with the people over 40 but yet still also the energy of the men so let's see um, you have the energy of uh, the the princess okay so some of you men or some of you younger people are going to have a situation with the energy of the princess and whatever the situation is this is someone who is between the ages of 18 to 40 someone between the ages of 18 to 40 okay whoever this person is there is going to be um, a situation that ends okay so it could be that this person whoever this person is whoever she is or it could be um, um, yourself if you're between the ages of 18 and um, 40 you're going to be having a situation to deal with either justice of something injustice that you have done it's going to come back to you this energy of this injustice that is going to come back to you is going to teach you a lesson because it's actually a karmatic situation that is about to end it's going to be teaching you something and whatever it's teaching you you need to take um, significant um, step to make sure that you learn this lesson so that you will never make um, this um, situation again as we look at the second week moving into um, the third week we are going to have the energy of cruelty in the reverse okay with the energy of cruelty in the reverse what this is saying is basically that whatever you have done injustice to someone else or it could be um, an unjust situation that has been done to you it was a form of cruelty that has situation to deal with with hate and and dishonest people and what is transpiring now is that whatever you have given out as return but now this lesson had ended and they need you to understand that whatever you have done um, um, towards someone else this is going to be and it could be in um, a work situation but it could be that you yourself are protecting yourself from um, someone the king of sword who is you know could be a father figure or someone who is older but this person is over the age of 40 and this could be an injustice situation that you have de dealt out by someone else and it is now affecting you in your life so be aware of um, whatever is transpiring but it's coming to an end whatever the situation was these situations are really really coming to an end now as we move forward we're looking at uh, um, the connection of uh, um, the fourth week and the last week and we have the energy of the king of um, sword okay so here I am 
I'm putting him in between so this is wonderful because you guys have the energy of um, the world but yet still um, all the energies of you um, air sign people the king of sword is coming up okay so whatever the situation was whatever that you men over the age you men and women over the age of 40 that has been going through you are going to need to find inner strength in the third week going into the fourth week you are going to be finding inner strength you need to calm yourself down because a judgment call is going to be coming and this judgment call is something that you have done injustice to someone else that is going to actually you you have to pay the consequences that is coming out you really really have to pay the consequences that is coming out so here we are and we're seeing the energy that you are all coming up so um, we have the energy of the princess and we have the energy of um, the, the 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 people over the age of 40 so you are dealing with a karmatic situation in this time and in this year okay so um, whatever that has transpired in your life it is actually coming out um, to 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 end a situation um, for you guys okay so this is something that you really really need to look at because of the energies that is end because there's a lot of fire energies and if you're looking you're seeing that the center of this month is going to have to um, deal with the people over the age of 40 so you're going to be having situation that has to do with people who are also Aquarius Gemini or Libran and whatever you have done or they have done to you it is uh, a sense of cleansing that is really really going to be coming in so let's look at um, what closes um, the first week and the second week with the king of swords what closes this um, the closing that is coming between the first and second week is the two of Pentacles in reverse so it's as if um, you're closing you're shutting off the financial help to your children could be that you're closing off the financial help to your children which is happening which is transpiring or it could be that you have decided um, to leave a situation behind because you're seeing that there is no more to the situation because of whatever that has transpired um, in the months before you're realizing that this is a really a karmatic situation and the energy of the world being um, the positive energy of this month it's ending this situation and um, bringing you a new start while you protect yourself to move on wonderful energies because closing off um, the second week on the third week you have the rewards coming in and these rewards are wonderful because whatever the rewards whatever that has transpired whatever loss that you have accomplish um, these losses are basically um, going to be removed and replaced with something much better and something much different and this is wonderful because the ace of Pentacles comes in so there is going to be a new start with your financial situation okay a very very new start with your financial situation and um, whatever that was there and whatever that has transpired um, uh, around your financial world it is going to be positive the outcomes is going to be victory okay the outcomes is going to be um, victory and this is wonderful because this energy of victory is going to be coming so you're ending the month on a good note because of whatever the transition is and whatever the transition that has taken place a lot of you guys a lot of you guys are going to be having happiness and joy you are going to be feeling really happy and having a lot of happiness and joy to move forward in your life which is going to help you to be understanding not only to yourself but also um, understanding towards the things the situation 
situation and the people as I look at this the middle and the center has to do this month as um, the energies are going to be coming up the endings and new beginnings for the people over the age of 40 so you need to be aware of this and you need to understand that life is about to change for you guys life is really really is about to change for you guys and this is going to be extremely positive um as we think of happiness and joy and victory um the glory is actually the victory you overcoming certain obstacles and you're handing um this month in a positive note of you um overcoming certain um, obstacles in your life and this is this is extremely positive so um, this is going to be um, a very very positive for you guys okay so um, we are going to go going in to look at the sign of uh, um, the Sun and moon sign people so let's um, place um, the Sun to the right and the moon to the left the Sun to the um, to the left and the moon to the right. Okay, so <clears throat> let's <clears throat> see what is coming out for you, Aquarian Sun sign people. Who do you have to work with in this month, and who is leaving your life? Who um, you are going to be resolving situation with and hand this understanding how situations are working out for you first of all you have two energies you have the energy of saturn and mercury okay saturn and mercury you have the energy of saturn and mercury working here for you guys which is saying that um um sorry sagittarius saturnus saturnus and whenever this planet comes in play that means expect a lot to remove out of your life and this you can see by the energy of the world um you are going to see that these changes that are coming in saturn energy this planet of saturn is going to be bringing these energies in to end the situation and then to bring this new start with um, the planet of mercury so for the sun sign people the people who were born for the sun sign people the people who were born um, 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 6 a.m. until 6 p.m. you are going to be working with Saturn and um, Mercury okay as we look forward we are going to be looking at the energy of the Luna and those are the moon sign people who were born um, People who were born um, actually um, um, after 6 a.m. and 6 um, p.m. midnight, um, you have to work with Pluto. Now, Pluto is actually res resurrection. Pluto is actually healing. Pluto is the energy of resurrection and actually healing things, healing situation in your life. And this is going to be extremely positive. So no matter what is happening a wonderful success new um, outcomes is going to be happening for um, you guys okay so let's see what other energies are coming out the energy of Gemini so a lot of you are going to be connecting with the Gemini's and um, not only connecting with the Gemini's but they will be helping you you moon people too um, have balance and bring out certain positive energies in your life and you are going to be understanding what will be motivating you to move forward in your life on a positive positive note okay so um, that's um, really 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 um, um, in a positive way these are coming out um, in this month and um, this is this is actually um, a positive sense of new situations that will align you in this month and by aligning you with the positive energies of this month because it's going to be five weeks you're going to be understanding how a certain situa situation takes a um, step in your life okay let's look we have two other energies the outsider 
the outsider. Some of you are going to feel as if you are an outsider in this month. Um, this always transpire whenever um, we feel left out in the cold. We feel as if we are the ones who are indifferent. Okay, whenever you um, become and you feel this way, you need to understand that you are not the one who is indifferent um, because the world is all about um, wanting, wanting, wanting the greed, the anger, the hate, and you are someone who is more of a peaceful spirit and a peaceful soul. Don't feel as if the outsider accept who you are and accept the indifference that is coming up for you because this is what the universe wants to let you know that there is nothing wrong with who you are do not feel left out as if you're the outsider because this is what needs to be happen this is how you really will connect with yourself in a soul soul um situation and this is going to be wonderful okay so I want to say um, to each and every person I'm wishing you a lot of luck um, in this month um, the energy of love is not really entirely um, the focus but I'm seeing a lot of people um, connecting with each other a lot of people seems to be looking out for each other a lot of people seems to be wanting to connect a new relationship um, the singles are going to be opening up to new people new situation and having forgiveness um, I'm, I'm seeing new relationships coming in for the singles and uh, for the people who are coupled it's as if um, some of you are going to be hand in coming out of certain relationship but yet still new relationships are going to be beginning for you guys for the young people it is going to be a time when you are going to decide whether am I going to choose um the part um for money or am I going to choose um the sense of uh, um being um with who I am and accepting who I am. So I want to say to each and every person, thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. I will see you next month. You will see me again in these monthly readings. Thank you. For your likes and share and success and namaste until next time please remember to like and share these videos thumbs up and um, leave your message thank you thank you so much for the support this card deck was donated um, um, donated from a subscriber who has asked me um, to keep these readings going so I hope you like this deck namaste until next time